Okay, on these catfish or basically any fish, if you get ready to flay, you come right here behind the gill, there's a hard bone right there, you come right around and down. And then when you come down the backbone after you get that cut, you put the knife in and come right down by the dorsal fin right through here. When you get past the rib cage, you can go all the way through with a knife and just come down the backbone to the tail right there. And then come back up and make your finished cut. You'll be cutting right around that line up and you'll peel the fillet off the ribs down. And once you get it peeled off the ribs, It'll all lay back and then you can just take the meat right off the skin. Right. You go in just and you feel it go down basically to the skin and then you turn your knife almost flat but just a very slight angle and you're sliding right across the skin. You can see the skin, there's nothing there. And there's your filet. Well, now that we've got all the fish filleted and cleaned up and washed and we put them on ice for a little bit to get them a little bit firmer and stuff, the next step to getting ready to prepare your food is I like to cut these into like nuggets or small strips. A uh, couple of reasons. The batter, you have more batter around all of them, your cornmeal, your batter whichever, whatever you like the best. They cook quicker. It seems like the fish cooks more even because you don't have that real thick piece and thin piece. So you, to me, you get an even cook on them and uh, you just get more batter. And I don't know, it, to me, it don't taste as fishy. All right, we're getting ready to batter these fish up. You just drop them in the bag and, and shake them up. Mike's don't be over here helping me. He's don't do the cooking. He's got that oil real hot. It's real simple. You just put them in the bag, shake them up. Get them covered real good. Shake them up. guys there you have it um, we went out on the water this morning uh, we caught the catfish uh, we cleaned them we cooked them we are now about to eat them uh, we went from field to fork or lake to, to fork and uh, I want to say thank you to my friend Anthony for coming and, and showing us how to fillet them and, and cook them and and for David coming out today and, and helping us catch them I thought it was a good day, it was a fun day, and uh, I think everyone should go out and try to do this because it was a blast. So uh, get out there and go fishing.